The ocean is Earth's last great frontier, a place where monsters once ruled, and none were more terrifying than the Megalodon, the largest shark to ever exist. This beast was so powerful, it could crush a car with a single bite, but then it vanished. Was it climate change, lack of food, or is there a chance this ancient predator still lurks in the unexplored depths? Today, we're diving into one of paleontology's greatest mysteries, the rise and fall of the Megalodon. On. We'll explore the science behind its extinction, examine the theories and even ask, could it still be out there? Stick around because this story is wilder than you think. What was the Megalodon? Before we uncover why it disappeared, let's meet the Megalodon. This wasn't just a big shark, it was the ultimate ocean predator, reigning from 20.6 million years ago during the Miocene and Pliocene epochs. Estimates suggest it grew 50 to 60 feet long. That's as long as a tractor trailer. For comparison, the largest great white shark ever recorded was about 20 feet. Megalodon's jaws were over 9 feet wide, lined with 7-inch serrated teeth perfect for slicing through whale blubber and bone. Fossilized teeth are how we know so much about this creature. These things are massive, some weigh over a pound, and they've been found on every continent except Antarctica, proving Megalodon was a global super predator. Its diet, mostly whales. Imagine a shark so powerful it could take down a 40-foot prehistoric sperm whale with ease, but then something changed. The golden age of Megalodon ended. So, what happened? Theory 1. Climate change and cooling oceans the most widely accepted theory, the world got colder. Around 3.6 million years ago, Earth entered a cooling phase. Glaciers expanded, sea levels dropped, and the warm coastal waters Megalodon relied on shrank. Megalodon was adapted to tropical and subtropical waters. But as the planet cooled, its hunting grounds disappeared. And here's the problem. Sharks are ectothermic, meaning they rely on external heat. Colder oceans, surgeon, slower metabolism, harder to hunt. Theory 2. Prey, scarcity and whale migration. Megalodon's favorite food, large whales, started migrating to colder waters. With fewer whales in warm seas, Megalodon faced starvation. Meanwhile, smaller, more adaptable predators like great white sharks and orca ancestors thrived. This was a domino effect. Less food led to fewer Megalodon pups surviving. Over generations, the species dwindled. Theory 3. Competition and evolutionary pressure. Speaking of competition, great whites were faster, more energy-efficient hunters. Orcas also emerged as intelligent pack hunters. Megalodon, a slow reproducing giant, couldn't keep up. So, was it one of these factors, or all three working together? Most scientists agree. Climate change was the final nail in the coffin, but could a few have survived? The deep sea mystery argument. Now, here's where things get controversial. The ocean is 95% unexplored, and the deep sea is Earth's last great mystery. Could Megalodon still be down there? Some point to viral videos and sonar blips of massive shapes. In 2018, a documentary even claimed a 50-foot shark was spotted near the Mariana Trench. But no hard evidence exists. Scientific rebuttal. Why it's impossible. Scientists say no chance. Here's why. No fossil evidence. If Megalodon were alive, we'd find fresh teeth or bite marks on whales. But the youngest fossils are 3.6 million years old. Gigantism requires food. A 60-foot shark would need huge prey constantly. Yet no unexplained whale massacres occur. Deep sea survival. The abyss lacks the warm food rich environments. Megalodon needed, plus pressure and cold would be deadly. So while it's fun to imagine, science says Megalodon is long gone. But the ocean always has surprises. Maybe another giant shark is still out there, waiting to be discovered. So what killed the Megalodon? A combination of climate change, prey loss, and competition sealed its fate. As for whether it still exists? Unless we find a live one, the answer is no. But the ocean is full of undiscovered giants. Who knows what we'll find next? 
What do you think? Could Megalodon still be out there? Let me know in the comments. And if you love deep sea mysteries, smash that like button, subscribe, and hit the bell. Thanks for watching.